Hmm. I know that sweet smell anyway. Come on! We can escape through that drain! Are you nuts? That's highly toxic warp drive coolant. We can't just jump in there. We need to keep moving. Maybe I wasn't clear. That's a pool of instant death. Whoa! Whoa. Drax! Drax, man, uh... Everything okay? Yes. Okay, so maybe it ain't warp drive coolant. <laughs> That's tingly. Well, we need to talk about your kid trying to kill us. Raker did something to her. This is his... Grand Unifier said Lictor droned into the lower halls. The heretics would have been disintegrated. Scott Halls? Yeah, maybe. But if we are lost, at least they can't find us? We're screwed. We're lost and we're screwed. I just need to get my bearings. I ain't never been on a ship this big. Trust your instincts, little one. Uh, little one? Eh, guess it's better than abomination. <laughs> you are a silly little thing. Are we sure the passport's still down? Cosmo needs to know what's going on here. Still down. What's the mutt gonna do anyways? Call Nova? Don't underestimate that old dog. He'll know what to do. Dog report must be delivered. our way forward so many doors you do know the way out right i do now there's gubbins you named it gubbins yup watch this he's gonna take us to the comm center there that's our exit okay we got this Idiots don't see us. They're trying to stand around fighting these two. The faster we get out, the faster we save Nikki. This is a pointless fight! Get us out of here, Quill! Crying! Thanks, Gubbins! Oh, 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 of course! He's one of us now! They're just gonna keep sending more guards! And we will continue to greet them! Rip of a new one! It is acceptable to ask for help, Peter Quill! Drax with the party, Drax! Move, move, move! Quark, get in here! Stand back! So, Gubbins is gonna need his own space on the Milano. Somebody's gonna have to give up their room. Fanatics only understand violence! Crap, it's a dead end. Now what? Up there! That cat walks our way out. If we can get across that gap... Flark, we got a bigger problem. Drone's back. Quill, find us a way up to that catwalk before we're extra crispy. Peter, tell me you've got an idea here. Drax, push that across the gap. Yes. No, 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 no! Wrong way, Drax! What the scut, man? That was our... Doesn't matter. We've got an exit. Let's go. Well, that thing really wants a piece of you. Too bad they're my pieces. We should keep moving. This doesn't look good, Peter. Is this some kind of torture chamber? 
They look peaceful. Hey, uh... Are you okay? I might as well be back on Half-World. Some of my fellow experiments bought into this kind of scud. The Kree scientists told them we were chosen, and they tailed the snout believed it. Even as they were dying. But you didn't. I was one of the smart ones. Me and, uh... Lila. And stand looking at him. Let's get the Flark out of here! I've had enough of this nightmare. Tell me we're close to your comm center. Gubbin sent us this way. He sent us to a dead end. It wasn't a dead end for him. Actually... <gasps> Let's just hope Drax's shortcut leads us in the same direction. Yes, a shortcut. considered going up or we could go down how where well, perhaps we should go inside before the storm arrives okay just just, just, just stop helping rocket do your magic yeah yeah just let me do it that must be the calm relay or take it off this heap so, uh, how long is this gonna take? I'm gonna need your help. Sure. All right. Just stand right here. Okay. Perfect. Why are we pretending we did not witness what we witnessed in the ceremonial chamber? Because the promise is an insidious lie. How can you be certain? Because I wanted to believe it, but I knew when I woke up it... <sighs> We'll all be gone. What did you see? My mom. Life. There was something else there, too. A shadow. Yeah, exactly. Whatever it is, it's using the girl. Probably fed her alive her own. About corrupt. I know she's. Walk it, Scott! What? That was completely intentional. The Milano's on her way. Thanks, bud. All right, let's split before the Faith Brigade realizes what we did. Where's the Milano supposed to dock? <laughs> it's cute they use the word dock. She doesn't have hangar clearance, so we're gonna have to get creative. Okay, just don't go overboard. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found a rendezvous spot near the hall. Wait, what? Relax. I know where we're going. <sighs> yeah.
<clears throat> Peter, there's a workbench we can use. Do it fast if you're gonna. That drone's still hunting us. Better safe than sorry. Let's get it done. All right. I doubt even you could break that. Now let's get out of here while we still can. Ugh. We need to get through here, but the stupid faith tech door ain't powered. So how do we charge it? Gotta find something compatible with that power port. Maybe I can just zap it? Runs on faith. Unless your guns can squeeze out some faith juice, we're screwed. <sighs> All right, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. Got a lazy death bot here. This battery might still have some juice. Worth a try. Okay, you just keep on... Whoa, whoa! <sighs> Not cool! Do you know what you're doing? Sure. Battery in the battery slot, right? Will this work? One way to find out. Hook it up. Looks like it worked. Drax, you coming, man? Drax? Hello? Nikki's running out of time. So are we. Hey, Drax. What's wrong? It has occurred to me that this may be nothing more than a lingering dream. It's not, I promise. But we need to go. Very well. Just... not now, bud. What is that? Yeah, that is kinda scary. I've never heard any ship make that noise. Not even Jatari. Is that... singing? More like distant chanting. Whatever it is, that's a lot of people. Guys, whatever's up there, I just want you to know that there's nobody I'd rather have uh, by my... Is now really the best time for a we're about to die speech? That's not what I'm doing. Flock, whatever that is, it's really close. Millions of them. At least. Yeah, and how are we supposed to help? We need to worry about getting our own tails off this death trap. We survive. Then we make sure Cosmo knows everything about this nightmare. He'll know what to do. The church comes for us! Flark! Think we can hijack that skiff? Probably. It'll be an ugly hack. Safety's off, people! I'm surprised your gun even has a safety! Hope the rest of you are as ready for this as I am! Yeah, this whole ship stinks. It's body odor. Faithful don't seem to wash. Okay, let's see what we can do with this gun. Come on. Come on. You sure you can- Whoa! 
If just one small faith battery can power one of their robots, imagine the power they harness here. And they're conquering planets now. Even this is small scale. Did you hear that? Hear what? There was... No! We're okay. They're just bouncing off the shield. What the scut? Shields down! Blast them! Keep your heads down! I got this! They're closing in! Never seen goons so eager to die! Why do they fight us? Because they're a loony space cult? Probably the church's capital ship, right? Sure looks like it. And we know they have the rock and all the ships docked there. There's no end to them! Rocky, can you outrun them? How? We've got the same skiff! Crap, the shield blow! You gotta keep them off of us! Just watch your back, bud! They got home ship advantage! How bad is it? Man, I gotta put her down. Ah. Ah, get the block off of my platform. Ah, ah, ah. They're crawling out of the woodwork. Yes, they're on the right Not good. Get ready for a fight. Man, are we even putting a dent in this guy? Unleash me onto these fools! Focus what's right into that one! Another skiff here! You want to get onto another one of those death traps? You want to stay on this one? Good point! Where's the shield? I don't know! It ain't working! Gonna have to do without it! They're on us again! Hang on. You feel that? No. The vibrations are different here. We're getting close to the edge of the ship, and our way out of here. You can detect that? Hello? Whiskers?
Wait, something... There he is! I'm going after Raker! Don't follow! What? Gamora! Uh, Trust me, Peter! Uh-oh. We got another scut ton of goons coming our way. Blitz of rocket! Root Board again, just in case. What did he say? He says he has been, but it still don't work. Me and that dog are gonna have words. You. Let's see those vines, Groot. Gamora don't catch up. Once they realize we're on the Milano, they'll throw everything they got at us. I will not flark! How's that thing still dogging us? Run! Go! I hate everything in this ship! Go, go, go! I only got a little left! It's your feet, Peter Quill! These boots are heavy, okay? We're almost out, right? Jump! What? Jump! We need to keep moving forward, Quill! Oh, you got it! I have slain the burrito! We can't keep outrunning the whole army! We gotta cut them off, we're gonna die here! I... I got an idea. Maybe I can overload these batteries, make this part of the ship go boom! How big of a boom are we talking about? Can't wait to find out! Keep them busy while I rig this place! There come the creeps. I need time, Quill! Keeping the fork off my tail! Uh, this battle must end! Keep on keeping them busy, Drax! Help, Rex! Prepare for pain! Oh yeah! This is going to be Rocket, how's it going? <laughs> Don't distract me when I'm pot deep in explosives! My knuckles fail to crack this metallic carapace! Crush him, Drax! Rocket! I hope you have a surprise for them! Mario loves surprises! Well done, you two! A tactfully executed maneuver! Peter Quill! Okay, they set the blow! We need to get the flark out of here! How much time do we have? I might have overdone it. Run! No! Lucky wizard!
must go back. Are you crazy? I like killing sprees as much as the next guy, but we barely got out of there alive. What about Gamora? She, she made a choice. So you're just gonna abandon her? And Nikki? What if it was Groot? You gonna leave him behind too? I am Groot. Don't talk like that. That's not what this is about. Isn't it though? We're supposed to be a team. Teams don't leave people behind. Tell that to the giant Kratakan army of robots and brainwashed believers we barely got away from! Gamora! Is that...? Yes. How'd you get back? It doesn't matter. I failed. Raker lives. For now. We have to go back. We can't leave Nikki there. What he'll turn her into. Blah, blah, flark and blah. So you got stepdaddy issues and had a horrible childhood. Ooh, rocket! What? It's true. Guess what? You ain't the only one here who had it bad. It don't mean we're angling to commit suicide because some pseudo priest nutjob is doing surprise nutjob stuff. If we go back there, we're dead. D E D, dead. Are you good? I'd rather die with honor than without. Crawled up her butt and died. I am good. So, get the Flark out of Dodge? Not yet. We should try to get a hold of Cosmo instead. I am good. Great plan, only he ain't answering the passport. Okay, but what choice do we have? We don't have comms. Well, actually, we uh, might have comms. It turns out they weren't as Flarked as I originally thought. Really? Groot should be able to race. Okay. Sounds like Murder Mom's feeling more stabby than usual. Hey! Better not slice through anything in that cargo bay! We ain't restocking anytime soon! I am Groot! Harsh! Excuse me, I ain't the one advocating to throw ourselves to the Florkins. Right, Drax? Yes. You all right there, Drax? I am pondering that question. And that makes total sense. After what happened with Nikki and that twisted promise, having to watch the people we love die all over again. My family did not simply die. They were murdered by Thanos. I think I'm... I do not wish to discuss it. So, uh, Drex, you feeling sucky because Quill took my side? Hey, Rocket, you got a minute? Ain't this a nice bench? Perfect for tinkering. All that effort, and nothing shiny to show for it. Shame. Why, yes. I am the handsome leader of the Guardians of the Galaxy. <clears throat> uh, Gamora! I was only looking... Relax. I'm not gonna kill you. This time. Okay, good. I, uh, actually... never got a chance to say thank you. For the doll. Oh. <laughs> no problem. I know how you like this kind of stuff. It was very thoughtful. I can count on one hand the number of times someone has given me a present without expecting something in return. Wow. Um, Christmas gifts from Thanos must have really sucked. That's putting it lightly. 
Thanos wasn't the giving type. Everything was a mind game designed to control us. Gifts included. So thank yous aren't exactly my strong suit. Something Mantis says I need to work on. How do you know Mantis? Did she give you one of her weirdo fortunes or something? Not exactly. How do you know her? Uh, I maybe tried to pick her up in a bar once. And how'd that work out? Good. Until she did the creepy antenna thing. I was half expecting her to start chanting, Red Rom, Red Rom. Red what? Doesn't matter. Point is, she's a wacko for sure. A really hot wacko. Who happens to be your friend? Yeah, well, that wacko saved my life. A few years ago. Someone got the jump on me. An assassin. Nearly killed me. Mantis happened to be in the right place at the right time. Seems to have a knack for that. <laughs> yeah. Turns out I had no idea how badly I need someone like her in my life. Up until then, I'd been so... Lonely. After the war, the Resistance disbanded. Richard Ryder got busy with politics, and the world mine had no use for someone like me. An assassin? Something like that. Thanos trained me to be a weapon, not a peacekeeper. Once a weapon, always a weapon, you know? Is that why Mantis mentioned suicidal urges? Because I get it. I've, I've been there. I'm pretty sure we've all been there at some point. Let's just say I'm not in that place anymore. Because of Mantis. She showed me another way. A place where maybe I can be needed. What kind of gifts did Thanos give you? Weapons, poison, the metal wire thing you used to strangle people with? He gave us dolls. Once. Stupid, ugly things from Xandar. Wow, okay. That's... surprisingly girly. What? I can't be feminine? No, just... I was really sure it was gonna be a knife or something. Like I said, Thanos liked mind games. It was unusual for him to be... kind. We didn't even have a bedroom. Yet here were these dolls. Purposeless. And they were ours. Do you still have it? Like, is it in your collection? No. I lost the one Thanos gave me when I was six. She was the ugliest doll I'd ever seen. I cried so hard when I lost her. <sighs> Nebula hurt me. She loved her doll, and I knew she wanted another one. So when she came in to check, we started to fight. Bet Thanos loved that. He found us fighting, saw my tears, and... laughed. Turns out, the dolls were a lesson on the importance of not getting attached. To help us understand that, he took Nebula's doll and threw it into the incinerator. That's... I can't imagine. Nebula didn't understand why he did it. Only that I was somehow responsible. I started collecting these a few years ago. After Nebula. After I knew I'd never see her again. It's dumb, but I guess I'd do it for her. Wow. I'm glad I bought this for you. And I can promise that there are zero strings attached to anything I give you. You're an important part of this team, Gamora. Uh, thanks, Peter. Uh, truly. Somebody makes the right call and gets us out of the way of those church idiots. Um... <laughs>
It ain't cowardice, it's common sense. Wait, are you siding with Green Team on this? Yeah, well, a little bit is all we'd achieve before getting brain scrubbed and tied up to faith reactors. One whole arm. That's what? 10% of Raker down? And I say we leave the other 90% alone. Can't say I ain't glad I get to dissect this little marvel. But that's as close as I'm getting to this flarking cult ever again. Shoo, shoo. Move over. What are you looking at? Oh no. You ain't chewing through any more of my ship. My ship? Shoo! Flark off! Wow, that panel must have looked really tasty. What's it for, anyways? Emergency door controls for the ship. Something a ship owner should know. Hey, do I look like an engineer? You don't. Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy. Where have you been? We've been calling you. Sorry, Pyotr Quill. Cosmos ball has been tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. What? Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is of shutdown for safety. He's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Yet. This problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask World Mind for help instead. Cosmo unable to get through. Guardian of Galaxies must actually. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? I am brute. These are the cowards who defiled Lady Hellbender's honor. Oh, good. And who the flark are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. But my contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Therefore, abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory, leader of the Lethal Legion. A uh, lethal legion? Uh, more like loser legion. <laughs> he surrounded us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. Lady Hellbender sends a regard, so-called Guardians of the Galaxy. Prepare to be eliminated. No, you prepare to be eliminated. <laughs> Smooth. Eh, we got this. Probably. <sighs> Life form now, huh? 
still you. Peter, I'm picking up something. What? It appears I'll have to finish this myself. So you defeated my fighters. My cruiser will crush you. That's it? That's what you've been bragging about? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing. It's fun. I'm sure it's very comfortable. You will not be mocked! Then do something about it. Lady Skullshoot has the worst block in timing! Who's she here? Just for goons! This time! That did some real damage. Keep hitting his exhaust ports. Your strategy will work. Thanks. We just confirmed that it will. Starting to feel like we pissed off the whole galaxy. A good shot of them anyway. Really need to work on our PR. Moron. Protect our points. This guy's starting to sound like Rocket. It's called language efficiency, Quill. Yeah, I don't think the scrap sacks care if the galaxy's under siege. You know, contractors. We're contractors! Proves his point. We just tried to dump the problem on somebody else. You okay in there, Cap? Stay still and I'll shoot. Just kill them already! There's an arc to this! Feel bad, Guardians? Nope, not a thing. Milano definitely felt it. We really gotta take better care of the Milano! Yeah, you were a ship wash and a wax when this is all over. Right after you packed up all the holes. Ooh! Right up the exhaust port! Or how much these creeps are getting paid for killing us. Let me look up the contract real quick. Oh, 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 oh man. These guys are making jump change. Really? Oh. I am Glavi, warrior of... <laughs> Take that, Lady Skull Scut. I doubt we've seen the last of her. We'll worry about Lady Hellbender later. Let's just focus on getting to Xandar. Punch it. Girl needs a tune up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no bucket head near my. Wow. Talk about cosmic gridlock. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Open channel, Groot. Let's see what's going on. These ships come from converted worlds. They're refugees. I need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous domeheads, but they're, they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flarkin' deal. Relax, Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Groot. <sighs> Welcome to Nova Corps headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. Groot. I know, bud, but now we can all follow along with Starpan's mistakes. How may we assist you? I'm. Any other ideas? I am Groot. I am Groot. Hey, the fine? Connecting to banking services. I can't believe that worked. Guardians of the Galaxy. Explain yourselves. Hey, world mind. Long time no see. It's me, Peter Quill, Star Lord. And uh, it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. 
We need your help. To pay a fine? No. No, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. The galaxy cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass delusion known as the promise. Is sweeping its systems, converting all who encounter it. In less than, than three cycles, it has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts. Worlds and systems. Praxis 9. Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda Galaxy. All lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually. The world mine is a collective consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me in it. Look, we just escaped the Church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well... How to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know how to groom the feathers. Yeah, well, I know where you can buy hack Novacore helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. Th the point is, we've lived things, experienced things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We have overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. Good. So let's pull resources. However, given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is ill-advised. Now, if you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Zandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Zandarian culture is a lost cause! But you're Novacor's leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads. We do, we do not, not have a duty to protect this galaxy. galaxy. We, we merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only yourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. We have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The risk is too great. It would be a pointless sacrifice. For unknown reasons. The church is stockpiling resources. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We cannot adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? Faith, as an energy source, is illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If, if the power source cannot be quantified, it, it cannot be countered. countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. Don't you control the Nova Force? The magical energy that powers Nova Core? It... it is not magical. But yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. It exists because we exist, and we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Raker with other people's faith. Maybe the way you do it can tell you how the Church does. Perhaps. You, you have, have given us new data to consider. Guardians of the Galaxy, we will. Later. Right now we need to focus on our departure. You're still leaving? We did we do not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what, who, 
I am Warlock, the Church's original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished. In the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We are, we are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, no guardians. guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money. All right, let's get this over with. Confirm payment. Oh, what? Whole universe is about to end, and you spend our cash on a Nova Corps fine. Look, dude, the church is about to come for all of us. Once that disabler goes off, we'll be sitting ducks. All right, at least we got that sorted. Let's get out of here. Peter, we've got movement. I'm Groot. They're taking off. Jump, Quill. I know. Peter's promise is becoming real. Peter? We gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! Scott! Whoa! What the flark did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The Loser Legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. I am Groot. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Guys. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the flocking water. Even if they find us, we're screwed. Freely accepted. Oh, Groot. yeah. And without an engine, we're screwed Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff. And what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. Don't. I just... can't do this right now. I need some rest. Core. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. <laughs> 